60,000 items are getting deleted, yeah. So once that's done, you guys should be able to just open Roblox back up and it should be just fine. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you new methods on how to prevent and how to remove the Roblox 268 error. So hopefully guys, enjoy. So I know you guys are in trouble if you're looking for this video. I mean, you got the 268 error and maybe you've been using a little bit of JG's blue or kernel here and there. But don't worry because I'm gonna be showing you how to prevent the 268 error and now fix it if you already have it. So let's actually start off with ways to prevent it. And if you're not interested in that and you just wanna fix it right now, even though you're probably just gonna get it again if you don't know how to prevent it, then just skip to this part of the video. I don't know where it is, but just skip there, okay? There's several reasons you guys can get the 268 unexpected Roblox error. Making sure you're not using the Microsoft version. So sometimes that Microsoft Store version of Roblox does have some issues, and I, I always recommend you know your browser version of Roblox that you download from your browser. I think that version is much more flushed out, is way easier to use, and I definitely recommend that version. So if you guys are having the 268 error again and again, try just switching your Roblox version to using the browser version, and that should hopefully help prevent some of these 268 happenings. And one of the top number one reasons is using a detected exploit. Now, it's not always the exploit's fault, but 90% of the times it is the exploit you're using's fault. So every time Roblox updates, your executors get detected. And some exploits don't do the due diligence and update the moment it Roblox also updates, and they just release an exploit that is detected, which will result in your account getting 268 banned. And if you guys are saying, 268 banned, that's not a thing. I'm just 268 error. And actually the 268 error 90% of the times, especially if you're using a detected exploit, is gonna be a ban. So it's gonna be a temporary ban that basically makes your account unplayable on your computer. So one of the number one way to prevent this is from using an actual good exploit. For example, SynapseX, Scriptware, Evon. Evon is free and keyless. You guys can get it in the last link in the description. And things like kernel actually got detected the last week's update because they updated the moment Roblox updated and it was still detected. And even though it was updated and functional, you still couldn't play. And one of the last ways to prevent and try to make the 268 errors not appear in the first place is actually disabling your firewall slash antivirus. Depending on your antivirus or firewall, your antivirus or firewall can block Roblox and make it think you're doing something suspicious, trying to do something malicious, and Roblox will end up blocking you with the 268 error. So that's something obviously you're not trying to do, but that's what Roblox thinks, and it's obviously a false positive. You guys know what a false positive is by now, if you ha if you don't. Now you know. Make sure to always try to turn off your antivirus or firewall, and even both if you ever get the 268 error when you're playing Roblox. It really won't be the case most times, but it's always worth a try, especially if you're using an antivirus that is not Windows Defender. Windows Defender will 90% of the times be just fine, but if you're using something else, definitely give it a try. Enough of the boring stuff you guys are not interested in, okay? I, I, don't, I don't care about getting it, I, I just want to get rid of it. Okay. Fair, fair enough. So let me show you guys my personal number one way to fix this. So all you need to do is go down to the left on your Windows computer and on the search bar, do percent temp percent. And then you'll see this folder that says temp percent. Yeah, yeah, you get it. So open that and now you'll see a bunch of these stuff. Now, I don't know what this is, but it's lots of stuff. I mean, look how, look how, wow. That's a lot of stuff. So what you're gonna wanna do is Delete this stuff. Not need. Ugh. It goes quite far down. Okay, you know, I'm not gonna do this. How many things are in there? 10, 10 13, 15, 20, 22, 25, 30. Okay, that's fine. You guys can also just give uh, administrative permissions, but uh, if you don't want to, that's fine. 60,000 items are getting deleted, yeah. So once that's done, you guys should ha be able to just open Roblox back up and it should be just fine. But of course there's plenty of other solutions which I'll be telling you right now. So you guys can either test that out right now or just give it a second and I can show you a few more options you can try in just a second. That's three, come on. Leak, please. This is gonna take a while, I'm gonna be honest. Why is it recycling it? Just throw it away. <laughs> guys, I don't know how long it's been uninstalling these all items. I mean, they look gone, so. 
Yeah. Let's move on to the next method though to fix the 268 error, which is gonna be uninstall Roblox. Just delete, delete, uninstall kid, uninstall. Okay, I'm joking, but it does include uninstalling. So first what you're gonna wanna do is uninstall Roblox and then restart your PC and wait 30 minutes to an hour. Now I know guys, going 30 minutes to one hour without playing Roblox, extremely difficult, okay, you might. I don't, I don't know what will happen, but you guys will have to do it in order to remove the 268 error if this method doesn't work and this is what you wanna do. And then after 30 minutes to an hour has passed, of course, reinstall Roblox, log back in, all that good stuff, and it should work just fine. But that's not the last method. The last method is actually using Yvonne. And Yvonne, if you go to the settings section over here, and then you go to the bottom, right under UI settings, you're gonna see 268 F fixer. And literally all you needed to do to fix the 268 error with Yvonne is click on a button, which in my opinion is much simpler than all the other options I just showed you. But of course you should always take the precautions to try to avoid getting the 268 error in the first place and using a detected executor, using a really strong antivirus, of course using the Microsoft Store version of Roblox. So always just try to avoid it but if you guys do get it, Yvonne is a really easy way to fix your error because literally you click. And then if it ever has any issues, you guys can always revert it. And just like that, your issue will be solved once again. And you guys can learn how to get Yvonne right there. And the first link in the description, I show you exactly how to get it 100% safely as long as you actually follow the tutorial. But yeah. That's basically how you guys can easily fix the 268 errors. But if you guys are still having the issue, you've tried all the methods, you come back to the video after an hour or two, and you know, none of the methods worked. What you guys can do is actually check out the other video I did, which has five more methods that you guys can test out, which of course are older methods, but they will still have a chance of working. That video also doesn't include any ways on how to prevent getting the 268 error in the first place, but Definitely a good choice if you guys still have it and you still can't get rid of it and you don't care about keeping it away. But anyways, I really appreciate you for sticking along till the end of the video. You know, that shows the most support of the channel. Hold up, watch this frag, guys. Watch this. Watch this. I'm about to destroy everybody. Okay, look, look. Watch, watch this, guys. Bam. Oh my gosh. Oh my. Oh, look at this. Okay, I need to reload. Oh, look at this. Oh my. G give, give, it, give it up a hand, comment down below, W sock, plot, Arsenal player. I haven't played Arsenal in like a month and like, look how cracked I am, come on. But anyways, I appreciate you for sticking along till the end of the video. You support the channel the most, so thank you for sticking along till the end and hopefully I'll catch you all in the next video. See you guys.